Impact of Nigerian Music in Africa Music is a social activity in which almost everyone participates in Africa. Music highlights African values by incorporating various traditions that are accompanied by a melody. Music is used to commemorate many important events, such as marriages, births, and rites of passage. In terms of cultural output, social connectedness, and internet influence, Nigerian music is incomparable to that of other African countries. Others, as well as the most ardently adventurous audience, remain in the dark about the country's artistry. Many people attributed Nigerian music's success to the country's population. Others believe that Nigerian musicians are more sedulous than their African counterparts. Though both schools of thought contain some truth, they are not factual. But what are the impacts of Nigerian music in Africa? Stay with us as we unravel the impacts of Nigerian music in Africa. Unity and connectivity. Although there are many different types of music in Africa, there are some common elements, particularly within regions. The concept of music in Africa, particularly in sub-Saharan Africa, differs from that of other regions and cultures. In sub-Saharan Africa, the roles of music and dance are intertwined, and music intersects with every aspect of life, expressing life through the medium of sound. Music, by helping to mark significant life events, helps to emphasize the divine and eternal value of human life. Nigeria music also helps to bring people together in a variety of ways, strengthening the fabric of the community and reinforcing people's commitment to supporting one another and the community in the pursuit of mutual health and prosperity. Another important function of music in Africa is as a mode of communication. Talking drums, signal drums, songs, and great sagas all communicate different types of important information. Developing new talent across Africa and the world. For many years, the phrase Africa rising referred to the continent's expanding economies and thriving business environment. However, it's becoming clear that the phrase could equally apply to Nigeria's music scene. Burner Boy won a Grammy in 2021 for his album Twice As Tall, and he has appeared on tracks by Sia, Justin Bieber, and John Legend. <laughs> Burner Boy! Not to mention the collaborations between Kenyan artists such as Soti Soul and India Ari, as well as Ghana's Kwesi Arthur and British rap giant Stormzy. Social media, meanwhile, has further amplified the ability of Nigerian artists to grab the world's attention. The virility of Essence by Whiskey, featuring Justin Bieber and Thames and Fireboy DML's Peru, are two of the more recent examples of this. At Spotify, we've witnessed this growth firsthand. Over the last year alone, the Nigerian alt genre has grown by over 200%. Economic growth. It is no surprise that Nigeria music is one of the driving forces of the country and the continent at large. With the top class artists and talents that are found in this country, the country is in a state of economic boom. Artists such as Davido, Burna Boy, WizKid, and much more have become brand ambassadors for top companies and brands. Also, these superstars do not only have companies and businesses in their home country, but across the entire African continent. Thus bringing in income to the countries and promoting economic growth in the continent. A significant portion of the Nigerian figure is derived from digital consumption, a segment of the market that has significantly boosted the industry in Nigeria and paved the way for more local artists to participate in this space. Digital music consumption and revenue surpassed physical music revenue in Nigeria as early as 2013, and the trend is expected to continue. Globally and in Nigeria, the supply chain has undergone significant change. Prior to the digital era, the primary channels of distribution were physical retailers, analog radio, public performance, films, and television. Digital downloads, on-demand streaming, 
and digital radio are now available as delivery channels. According to the International Federation of the Phonographic Industry's Global Music Report 2017, global recorded music revenues increased by 5.9% in 2016, with 112 million users of paid streaming subscriptions driving 60.4% growth in streaming revenue and digital income accounting for 50% of global music industry revenues. In Nigeria, mobile accounts for nearly 99% of digital music revenue, with ringtones accounting for the majority of it. Over the next five years, the figure is expected to rise even further, while download revenue is expected to decline and streaming revenue to remain low. So far, Nigeria's music industry has progressed without a clear structure, but this has not deterred foreign interest. Two of the world's largest music companies, Sony Music and Universal Music, have opened offices in Nigeria in the last two years. Sony, which arrived a year before Universal, has already signed contracts with up to seven top Nigerian musicians. More jobs in music and entertainment will be created for Nigerians and Africans as a result of this. Thanks for watching. Please like the video, share it, comment and subscribe to Africa Reloaded for more amazing videos.